The Vikings, fierce warriors and skilled seafarers emerged from the rugged landscapes of Scandinavia around 800 CE. Their homeland encompassed Denmark, Norway and Sweden. These lands with their long coastlines and harsh winters shaped the Vikings' character. The Vikings were not a unified nation but a collection of independent chiefdoms. They shared a common Norse language, cultural practices and a thirst for adventure. These early Vikings were farmers, fishermen and traders. They lived in small villages ruled by local chieftains. Their lives were closely intertwined with the sea which provided them with food and the means of transportation. The Vikings' mastery of shipbuilding and navigation would later allow them to embark on daring voyages across the world. The year 793 CE marked a turning point in history, the raid on the Lindisfarne Monastery in England. This brutal attack shocked the Christian world and heralded the beginning of a new era. This event, recorded by horrified monks, signaled the beginning of the Viking Age. The monks' detailed accounts provide a vivid picture of the terror and chaos that ensued. The Vikings, driven by a combination of factors, began to raid and plunder settlements across Europe. Their sudden and violent incursions left many communities in ruins, overpopulation, internal conflicts, and a desire for wealth and land fueled their expansion. The harsh Scandinavian environment pushed them to seek new territories and resources. The Vikings' superior ships, the longships, gave them a distinct advantage. These vessels were not only fast, but also capable of navigating both open seas and shallow rivers. These sleek and versatile vessels allowed them to navigate rivers and seas with ease. Their ability to travel great distances quickly enabled them to strike unexpectedly. They could strike quickly and disappear just as fast, leaving a trail of fear and destruction in their wake. Villages were often left burning, with survivors fleeing in terror. The Vikings' reputation as fierce warriors spread like wildfire striking terror into the hearts of their enemies. Their relentless raids and formidable combat skills made them a force to be reckoned with across Europe. Beyond their raids, the Vikings were also skilled traders and settlers. They established trade routes and settlements that stretched from the British Isles to the far reaches of Russia. Their cultural influence was profound, leaving a lasting legacy in the regions they touched. From art and craftsmanship to language and governance, the impact of the Viking Age is still felt today. Viking society was strictly hierarchical with a clear division between three main classes, Jarls, Karls and Thralls. At the top of the social pyramid were the Jarls, the chieftain class. These powerful individuals controlled land, resources and warriors. They commanded respect and obedience from those below them. Karls, the freemen, made up the majority of Viking society. They were farmers, fishermen, craftsmen and warriors who owed loyalty to their Jarl. Karls valued personal freedom and had a say in matters affecting their community. At the bottom of the social ladder were the thralls, slaves who were either captured in war or born into slavery. They had no rights and were considered property of their owners. The Vikings' world was steeped in mythology and a belief in powerful gods. Their religion was polytheistic, with a pantheon of deities who controlled various aspects of life, death and the cosmos. Odin, the Allfather, was the god of wisdom, war and magic. He was revered for his knowledge and cunning. Thor, the god of thunder, was a symbol of strength and protection. He was often depicted wielding his mighty hammer, Mjolnir. Freyja, the goddess of love, beauty and fertility, was associated with magic and Seder. A form of Norse magic, the Vikings believed that their gods influenced their daily lives and sought their favour through rituals and sacrifices. Section 5. Living on the edge, sustenance and survival in the Viking Age. Life for the Vikings was harsh and unforgiving. They faced brutal winters, unpredictable weather and a rugged landscape that tested their resilience daily. They lived in a world where survival depended on their skills, resourcefulness and, well, a bit of luck. Every member of the community had a role to play, from the blacksmith forging tools to the warriors honing their combat skills and families working together to ensure their collective survival. Their diet consisted mainly of what they could hunt, fish, farm and gather. The Vikings were adept at utilising the natural resources around them, turning the harsh environment into a source of sustenance. Fish, particularly herring and cod, was a staple food. 
The seas and rivers provided a reliable source of protein and fishing was a crucial activity for their survival. This was supplemented by grains like barley and oats which they cultivated in the short growing season. These grains were essential for making bread and porridge staples in the Viking diet. Meat from livestock like sheep, goats and pigs was a luxury reserved for special occasions. Feasts were significant events, bringing the community together to celebrate and share their bounty. They also gathered berries, nuts and wild herbs to supplement their diet. These foraged foods added variety and essential nutrients to their meals. Viking cooking methods were simple yet effective. They relied on open fires, clay ovens and cooking pits to prepare their meals. These methods allowed them to cook a variety of dishes, from roasted meats to baked bread, ensuring they could make the most of their available resources. They preserved food through smoking, salting and fermenting. These techniques were vital for storing food and ensuring they had enough to last through the long, harsh winter months. Ensuring their survival during the long winter months required careful planning and preparation. The Vikings' ability to store and preserve food was a testament to their ingenuity and adaptability in the face of adversity. Section 6. Beyond the Horizon Raids, Trade and Exploration While the Vikings are often remembered for their raids, they were also skilled traders and explorers. They established extensive trade networks across Europe, Asia and even North America. Their longships, capable of navigating rivers and open seas, carried goods such as furs, timber, slaves and luxury items. The Vikings' thirst for exploration led them to discover new lands and establish settlements far from their Scandinavian homeland. Leif Erikson, a Norse explorer, is credited with reaching North America around 1000 CE, nearly 500 years before Christopher Columbus. They established a short-lived settlement at Lancer aux Meadows in Newfoundland, Canada. Section 7. Twilight of the Gods, the Waning of the Viking Age. The Viking Age, a period of intense raiding, trading and exploration, gradually came to an end by the mid-11th century. Several factors contributed to their decline, including the rise of powerful kingdoms in Europe, the Christianization of Scandinavia and climate change. As European kingdoms grew stronger, they developed better defences against Viking raids. The gradual conversion of Scandinavia to Christianity also played a role in the Vikings' decline. As they adopted Christianity, their raiding activities, often targeting wealthy monasteries, became less acceptable. Additionally, climate change, including a period of cooling temperatures, made farming more difficult in Scandinavia, reducing their resources. Section 8. Legends etched in rune iconic figures of the Viking world. The Viking Age produced numerous legendary figures whose exploits have captivated imaginations for centuries. Ragnar Lothbrok, a legendary Viking warrior and king, is said to have raided England and France, becoming a thorn in the side of King Charles the Bald. His sons, including Ivar the Boneless, continued his legacy of raiding and conquest. Lagatha, a legendary Viking shield maiden, is said to have fought alongside Ragnar Lothbrok. She's described as a fierce warrior and skilled strategist who commanded respect on the battlefield. Leif Erikson, a Norse explorer, is credited with reaching North America around 1000 CE, demonstrating the Vikings' seafaring prowess and spirit of exploration. Section 9. Enduring Legacy, the Viking's Mark on History. The Vikings, despite their reputation as fierce raiders, left an indelible mark on history. Known for their seafaring prowess and fearsome raids, they were much more than just warriors. They were explorers, traders and settlers who ventured far beyond their Scandinavian homelands. They influenced the course of European politics, trade and culture. Their expeditions took them to the British Isles, the coasts of France, and even as far as the Mediterranean and North America. They established trade routes that connected distant lands, facilitating the exchange of goods, ideas and technologies. Their raids and conquests led to the establishment of new kingdoms and the displacement of populations. The Danelaw in England and the Duchy of Normandy in France are just two examples of territories that were significantly shaped by Viking influence. Their trade networks were vast, stretching from the Middle East to the North Atlantic. They traded in everything from furs and amber to slaves and silver, creating a web of connections that spanned continents. 
This extensive trade network not only brought wealth but also facilitated cultural exchanges that enriched both the Vikings and the people they traded with. Their genes can still be found in populations across Europe and beyond, a testament to their wide-ranging travels and interactions. Modern DNA analysis has revealed the extent of their genetic legacy, showing that many people today carry Viking ancestry. The Vikings' legacy continues to fascinate and inspire, as their culture and history are kept alive through archaeological discoveries, sagas and popular culture. From the epic tales of their gods and heroes to the artifacts unearthed from ancient burial sites, the story of the Vikings is one of adventure, exploration and enduring influence. They remind us of a time when the seas were highways and adventure awaited those brave enough to seek it. Their spirit of exploration and their impact on history continue to captivate our imaginations, reminding us of the enduring legacy of these remarkable seafarers.